We are back kicking it with the coaches at Carver High School in Montgomery this week. Head coach Marcus Gardner kind enough to give us some of his time. Coach, how are you? I'm all right. How about yourself? I'm doing great. Already three games down. The season's cruising. Week yes, four sir. is this week. Does it seem like it's going pretty fast? Uh, yes, sir. Uh, we start a week earlier than normal, so uh, really getting back into the groove. Uh, uh, we started slow in the beginning of the game, but we're working each week to get better. Tell me about this year's team. Last year, you guys sent two guys to the University of Alabama, so you had some big holes to fill. And you said as the season has progressed, you think you're starting to fill those spots. Yeah, we played a lot of 10 grades. A lot of uh, juniors been playing since they was in ninth grade. Uh, so those guys are getting the opportunity to step into the leadership role. Uh, like I said, it's just understanding how to do those uh, roles and pretty much getting acclimated to that, that, that system. Uh, so most guys are coming in like the last two weeks. I think we got better and better. So we're trying to get at least a mid-year uh, mid scheme so we can get better. You said week one was kind of a slow start. Yes, what have sir. you seen since then? What do you like about where this team's going now? Uh, the response from the second week, uh, we played a good Daphne team. Uh, they stepped in. Uh, it was all the way to the fourth quarter and the way they fought. Um, we was, uh, small details that we probably didn't get well, but they still play hard in the intensity that we know they can play with. If you know anything about Carver, the fans, the alumni are passionate. Yes, you see them on social media. Yes. What do you want Carver Nation to know about this team this year and what you guys are hoping to bring to the table? Uh, they're going to play hard. Uh, we're going to be working on getting disciplined and make sure we make it a run for the playoffs. Uh, uh, like we did last year, trying to make uh, another run for the region championship, uh, get into the playoff with a fair shot to go win the state championship. Russell County this week, you guys are sitting at two and one right now. What do you need to do this week to make that three and one? Uh, like I tell the guys, uh, we had our practice this morning. We're not worrying about Russell County anymore. We're trying to get better uh, each week so we can get into our mid-season form. You mentioned last week, Coach, you guys had a fantastic season last year, got to the playoffs and went out a lot sooner I know, than you would have liked to have gone yes, out. What's the message this season as far as not just getting to the playoffs, but then doing some damage once you get there? Uh, those, these guys know how to be successful. Uh, like I said, we're getting a fair shot at, at the playoffs. Whatever, all our guys, uh, we, we just want to make our opportunity. And when we get our opportunity, we'll uh, make everybody proud. I saw you guys have a new facility that's being built across campus. It'll eventually be a place for the players to change and shower and get ready. How excited are you to have that, hopefully, by sometime late this year, early next year? Uh, it's a huge addition. Uh, like I said, it's, uh, we're making shift uh, things we got right now, uh, but the guys deserve uh, those facilities. It's good that the system, MPS, is giving us uh, extra amenities so we can uh, do what the kids deserve, pretty much. We'll have to come back and visit that once that's done, Coach. Yeah, yeah, thank, thank you so much. You. Best thank of luck this week. You. All right, thank you. We appreciate you joining us. Coach Marcus Gardner, the Carver Wolverines. That's week's edition of Kicking It with the Coach.